And we'll just release this at the very end of the day. 2000 Only $2,000 for it. There's 45 bucks and 76 cows per bug, so that's 3,000. And it was also inadequate. Like, can I get some feedback? What? How bad was it? Quality penalty, 4,600. Was this considered horrible quality? They wanted bad quality, so I can't imagine it was that inadequate. But apparently, it was just like way the fuck off. Like, that's what I'm not understanding, is there's a lot of guesswork involved, but there's not much feedback for said guesswork. You just have to do the peer reviews, but the peer reviews take so much time, and time's very fucking limited. So I don't know... I'll close this to reopen it so it refreshes. Yeah, nothing new. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, cost per bug 36, 64, so we'll try this one. We'll try this one. We'll use SCM1. Horrible quality required. I think I can probably manage it. We'll let this get, uh, we'll just let it get all the way full. Just in case. It's got maximum potential. This could be released just in fantastic state. But it looks like we're pumping out the lines of code a hell of a lot better. Man. Okay. Maybe that's it. Maybe because I was doing the design stage, it doesn't make your coding more efficient. It just... You generate code. Faster. Oh. <laughs> this door is, uh... I'm gonna move the door real quick. <laughs> door. Wow, really? Just door. Oh, oh my god, typing door. <laughs> okay, reset grid. There we go. <laughs> uh, and to think there was a typing mini game that this had. Unless this is just a server that made the difference. I don't know. So much guesswork. It's the last day. Last day already. Have the client review it. Okay, they're thrilled with it. Okay, so let's promote it. Let's do some bug fixing. I won't be able to fix all the bugs. There's just no way. That is asking way too much. And around 1700 or so. Okay, there we go. 8,000. So now... Contract work. Done. It was adequate. And there were 22 bugs left, so minus 800. Okay. So, that design stage. Let's do another embedded system. Let the day run out real quick. Humir called in sick. Well, that's not a fair comparison then. Or is it? It's really not. Well, um... We'll do it anyway. Wow, okay, that went up way fast. Okay, fine. We'll just do this one proper then. I was gonna see about this first stage, just letting it not get very far at all and see if the code generation was much different. To see if that affects that. Overall, we're almost freezing. It is a little cold in here, but it's not that bad. Could, I could remove your fan. <laughs> Does that help? 12C. It's a little better. <laughs> so, we let this get pretty full. I mean, your efficiency is terrible. And dropping heavily. This place looks nice. No, it doesn't. Don't lie to me. Details. Temperature's what's fucking you right now. And I can get another heater in.
well, no, radiator. Put it, uh, Hmm. I'll move the plant. We'll put the radiator over there, because I'm going to get Thor there eventually. I know very a lot, right? I mean, that's why I had the ceiling fan. The ceiling fan's very noisy, though. If I do the vent... A little bit of electricity cost. Okay, the fan's actually a lot better. The durability is worse, but that's okay. We'll put the fan right in the corner. We'll see if the cubicle wall helps block that at all. I'm not really sure. There we go. We're, we're okay again. 16C, 17C. Okay. The extra radiator helps. Yeah, we'll just have to go into this the very last day that you have available, continue working on the lines of code, and just accept the fact that it's not going to be bug-free. Even if you had like three days to do bug fixing, I don't know if you'd be able to do it in time. Client review real quick, just to make sure. I love it, okay. 6,000 still the good mark. If you do a really good design stage. If the design's good, 6,000 lines of code is great. Otherwise, I'm not sure. 7,000. We're profiting still. Not hugely, but profiting. So if I were to develop software, I mean, I would need a... I'd need a, uh, a designer. Because I don't think either of us have any design skill, like, at all. Oh, no, I do. I'm a fantastic designer. Right. <laughs> right. Um... Chimera, educate for programming. We'll specialize in audio. 1800. Put you in there for two months. And I will just sit solo then. Oh, well. You're here today. I was gonna say, I'll sit here solo and do contracts while you do that. And then when you come back, we'll see about doing a quick audio tool type thing. Or maybe like a, well probably audio tool, that's what our specialty is. And uh, we'll see about just making something really quick and crude. We have no fans to lose. We have no recognition in any market at all. So you can probably just release something that's pretty shitty and still make money off of it. That's what I'm thinking. I won't really need to worry too much about printing. I could just buy the copies up front because we won't be selling very much. So it won't make a huge difference. I think, I think, I think. Let's have the client review at uh, 4,500 there. This was, again, horrible quality requested and they're thrilled with it. Okay. Yeah, I think the development stage, or the design stage rather, is definitely something that you don't want to half-ass. Because I interpreted that as it was back in the day, where if they wanted horrible quality, you just let that first development, or the design stage, you just let that get up just a little bit. Because horrible's like the first tier of that. But that is not how it is anymore. At all. It seems to affect the speed at which you code, the efficiency of said code, the probably the bugs that are in there too is probably hugely different. I mean, I'll spend most of the today doing the bug fixing because I may as well. It's adds up to hundreds of dollars eventually. 8,500. Probably pretty buggy. Yeah, done. Adequate. 21 bugs. That's minus 1,200. Okay. I think I forgot to do an SCM. <sighs> okay. Understood. Don't half-ass design. Okay, the environment's officially getting kind of shitty in here. I might need a call cleaning. <laughs> Oops. Ah. Um. Manage staff. Call cleaning. Probably call IT too. And that's IT waiting, yeah. 
Gonna be a minute, sir, because IT, you're not by the hour, right? Per repair, so you're gonna be here for as long as you need to be, sort of. Uh, go home. Go home so you can fix this. Ahem. <clears throat> there we go. <laughs> okay, so that's all working well. Everything in a decent state here that can be 78%, okay. So I don't need to really call maintenance. All right, just getting ready for our first project of sorts. Let's do that logistics application. Horrible 98 per bug. Okay. Well, let's not put in too many bugs, I guess. <laughs> I, I think I'm getting it. I thought I understood it, but I didn't understand it at all. And I think I'm getting it now. I mean, this is just flying up there now. That's ridiculous compared to what it used to be. With like four or five people working on it, the speed at which it would grow was terrible. Oh, hey, you're back. How fantastic are you? Mm, well, you're good at, good at audio, but you didn't actually get much skill. Ugh. All right. Well, you'll get that over time, I suppose. So, I've got design. You're just your strict programmer. I've got design. You've got programming, I've got programming. So we sort of have two programmers, one designer. Sort of. Two programmers, one designer. So I could just make a really quick, cheap, easy audio playback thing, go into it not expecting very much, and potentially do okay. I don't have any marketing. Would I need to market it though? Is it really crucial to market it even if I expect it to not be that great? Probably. Probably. Well, the client review it at 6,500, this should be plenty okay. Three reviews, yeah, they're happy with it, okay. Promote. Delay and bug fix. And you want to raise. You're requesting 280. I'll give you a light raise because you deserve a bit of a raise, but I'm not giving you that much. Sorry, just not happening. Are you like super pissed with the company now? The noise is a bit of a bother. Uh, the scrollings. Yeah, they're, they're still satisfied. They still got a raise. Not sure what to do for bug fixing. That just seems slow. Same with support tickets. Support tickets and bug fixing just seems slow, just in general. 24 bugs fixed, there's 11,000. Nice. How many bugs were left? Two. Okay. Awesome. Okay, it looks like it, I have multiple contracts going, but it looks like if you fixed all the bugs, Okay, well it was. It was 27 like all day, so I thought it sort of just, the speed just drops off as you try to find those last remaining bugs, but it looks like this varies in speed depending on how many bugs are left, so if I release it here, 10,000, there must have just been like a bug, maybe two. Okay, three, that's not that bad. All right. And this guy we did, um, I'd been doing overnight while we're away. I have the client review it. And then, like, as soon as they're coming into the office, their reviews are finishing up, and they've been happy around 4,000 to 5,000 lines of code if I let the design stage get all the way up. So, yeah, again, can't emphasize that enough. Design it well. It makes sense. I mean, I'm just <laughs> thinking about it in hindsight. I mean, yeah, you, you want it to be well designed. But it never used to be that way, and I keep trying to compare this alpha to last alpha, but you sort of have to treat it as a new game because it's changed massively. And all that's left really are game assets, which is tricky because it's art and we're terrible with art, so I don't really want to do it. <laughs> we'll SCM1 because I always forget that. 
and accept. And bing. And then we go home. While we're home, we have the client review it. As we come back in in the morning, the reviews are done. They're happy with this. At just 3,000 lines of code, they're happy with it, so we'll promote it. We have today and tomorrow to do bug fixing now. Ridiculous. If, uh, what's the noise overlay like? If I were to put a desk here, it's still really a lot. I would need to do, like, backing cubicle or something. Hmm. Hmm. I could have a door into the little break room. Giving us more room for more desks. If I were to build uh, some dub walls, no, some cup walls. That, that helped out generally a lot, but at the same time, we'll move the furniture. Yeah, okay, we're being loud now. Okay, so we'll move it again. And now it's tolerable. But employee isolation increases when we do this. But we have a water cooler, so... Fuck them. Is the bathroom loud? No. Okay. Yeah, I mean, all this stuff's noisy, so if I do do a doorway type thing... It would allow me to get a little more room for a desk, because I feel like I should get a marketer, you know? I feel like I should. And marketers, were they cheap? They're kind of cheap. They're sort of cheap. We'll pay them not very much. Wow, yeah, you're... You are fresh. You can be anything in the world, basically. <laughs> The idea was I would just send them off to do training, but Jesus, maybe, uh, that, yeah, that's, no, that's, that's terrible. We'll just save the hassle. 2,500, it's been 1,600 looking. I don't care about specialization. There you go. Great compatibility. I'll take that over anything. Absolutely. If you see great, jump on it and take it. And then... Manage employees... Natalie Caldwell. You are the new Verithan. We're going to educate you marketing for three months. And then if I were to manage teams, have you guys come in an hour later. So there's an hour uh, gap just to make sure the computers are free. And if I were to pick up then a programmer just to help out with uh, bug fixing and tickets and stuff like that overnight, that would be just superb. But I'll wait because, yeah, money. Still a day left? Shit, may as well. Let it keep going. Skip to the next day and pick up another contract. I'll start des uh, developing, uh, designing for this contract. We'll just bump the priority of that up a bit so I work on that instead of uh, the bug fixing, because that's not so critical. And promote. Even amount. 19 bugs. Seems solid. There's $11,000. Okay. Uh have the client review it. They're happy with it. Awesome. So we'll promote it. Cool. I get a... <laughs> it's just taking me a lot longer to actually get into it, but with two days per month I'm allowed to do this a little easier because 
uh, the years go by slower this way. Because if I were to do this otherwise, it would already be going on 1984 almost, which is just like, wow, Jesus, we should do something. But it's only been, it hasn't even been two years now. <laughs> Ignore all the rounding I just did. It's perfectly fine. Room's still doing pretty good for them. Computers, decent shape, okay. And promote. Have the uh, client review it. 1300 lines of code. Wow, okay. That's impressive. I wonder if this will ever say fixed all bugs. An employee is stressed. Hold on, pause. Let me get the details. What's driving you nuts? Just stress. A little bit the noise, but mostly just stress. I'm overworking you, I guess. Multiple projects at once will probably amplify any of that that's going on. Like, oh god, we're doing two contracts at once and they're bouncing between projects. And yeah, that makes sense. And then our marketers should be coming in soon, so let's move some stuff around here. Scoot you there for now. Do a door. Default size, so it's nice and flush. And then... Walls. What all would I be putting in there? Not a lot. I can probably keep the window. I can keep the window for him. And depends what all I put in. Let's go... Set as default style. And then... Reset the default style, so then you get copied over. We got the vending machine in there. The water goes in there. We can put the light in there. The light should still be somewhat okay here. Yeah, the lighting's just fine. All the windows helps. Put the plant in there. Looking a little less good now. So we'll go back and do plant and put in a floor plant and we'll throw it there. Oh, didn't really help much. Okay. <laughs> hmm. And then this room's getting uh pretty cold. So we'll need another, we'll need a rad. Mm -hmm. And then it'll probably get a little hot, but we'll see if I can deal with just that. So all that noise generating stuff is in there now. So we can get rid of these. We can, we'll put in windows. I was gonna put in a clock, but oh well. Do the windows, then you can still like, uh, you can't, the cubicle walls are in the way. It's gonna say like spy on the people working. Can we, can we spy on them? Sort of. You can, uh, if you lean, you can, uh, <laughs> you can sort of see <laughs> what they're doing in there. Sorry, just stand off to the side here. Just like huddle, huddle in this corner next to the lamp. I can't see you. Nefarious activities. And change the flooring style. I really just do the copy for the uh, the outside wall. And if we're doing bug fixing on that, oh god, just game assets. Never mind. <laughs> um. Right. The floor will change that over to 
the tile, I suppose, and the interior wall. Some basic. Yeah, we'll just do flat wall, that's fine. And then colors, the floor. Change that into a fairly, fairly nice gray. And the interior wall color sort of a vanilla, I guess. Not a very good vanilla, but oh well. Okay. So the noise now, I mean, granted we got this loud ass ceiling fan, but. <laughs> it's not so bad. We can easily fit in another desk, probably. Like. This. Occupied. Oh, is there a. Hold on. Walls up. We got a radiator there, don't we? Yep. Move it over to that wall. Move that to there. Get rid of this. Duplicate these. All right. Uh, half grid. There we go. Awesome. That is no problem. It gets heavy here because of all the typing. But yeah, I'm happy with it. How we doing here? Doing okay, sort of, ish, I guess. I suppose I could do develop software and we'll just start working on it just on the side when we can't do contracts, yeah? No harm in it, just a quick audio playback thing. What operating systems are out there? What are they using? I can always port it later. Active users. Two million active users in The Sloth 4 came out December of 78. So, been a little while. $7,000 for license, though. God, fuck it, I'm just gonna buy it. 85 million. Yeah, alright. So, we'll, we'll bite the bullet there. And just does audio playback and that's it. Team will be core and core two, just in case I decide to get a core two here. It'll be 1999. And we'll call it low pass zero. Trying again. There. So, I'm working on that on the side. After this contract, he's gonna have nothing to do. The marketer's gonna come in, have nothing to do. The marketer I'd like to just throw into education to um, potentially help out with uh, design or something. So you don't help out with the programming because that would entail doing uh, tickets and bug fixing and all that. But if I help you, if, you, if I have you help out with design, you can help out in this stage and the very end you can help market it and promote it and all that, so. Oh shit, that's overdue. Whoops, sorry. <clears throat> Got caught rambling. I guess we'll go for this. Uh, I guess. Huh. Uh, why aren't you working on it? Oh, because it's design only? I didn't get the salary I wanted. Oh, I'm still really happy though. Mm. Hmm. Art is design only. So if I change your role to any role. He's helping out with that. Okay. What's a client think about this? Only 171 kilobytes. We're so bad at this. Make sure it's on the server and all that. They can be like, oh god, yeah, they're pissed. They got pitchforks in hand if we give it to them in that state. Ugh. And the marketer should be here soon. Tomorrow, perhaps.
But if I keep the marketer in class and I teach them to do design, then they can help out with the art assets and stuff like that too. Hmm. Okay, it is due today. I'd like to get at least a megabyte. Oh, hey, you're in. Welcome. How'd, how'd school go? Fucking nailed it. Holy shit. You're so good. I'm gonna educate you in design now. Ideally, audio design. Three months. Have fun. I think that's a nice side job for the uh, marketers to do. And client review. I mean, you're gonna have to put up with it. I mean, no matter what, yeah, they're happy with it. They'll thank God. No bucks to fix, right? Because it's art. Yay! We did it! Uh, art assets are probably the easiest, but since I'm trying to go audio tools and I don't need artists for audio tools, it's... It's counterintuitive for me trying to go for them. But they're easy to do. There you go. Embedded system. Fucking finally something we can handle. <laughs> 